Little Heath is a really good school to go to and a sort of a community in a way. Everyone here was so welcoming. I was very happily making friends and it wasn't just my form that I made friends with, it was everyone throughout the school. There's a good crossover between years and the amount of times I see people just helping out each other. Like different year groups, they play together like football, basketball, table tennis or badminton at a sports hall. We have such supporting teachers and such nice children here and you'll find it so comfortable you'll fit in straight away. Staff are super supportive and I think it's really nice to have teachers that are there for you. They're firm but they're fair. They're all really nice. My favourite subject in Little Heath School is definitely music. And there are practice rooms where there are keyboards, drums, guitars and many instruments that you could borrow. I'm part of boys group and soul choir. Uh, we perform at the summer showcase and the winter concert as well. They do give you a lot of opportunities to perform on the big stage in concerts or in like bands and stuff like that. The science department are all really great here. Everyone's always around to help. The science labs are really good. Biology and chemistry I really like because we get to do lots of practicals. But doing that with a group can be really fun and you really do remember them because of how cool they are. The English department, they expand with reading different books and now I'm a complete bookworm and I'm in love with reading. The art department is really colourful and it's really vibrant. You've got a lot of uh, works from all different years so you can see year 7s to year 11s work. Some of the year 11 work is fantastic. The ICT rooms are really nice, they're air conditioned. There's lots of seats so you're not always squeezed up next to someone. The maths departments are really supportive. Yeah I remember in maths we worked on angles but we went around the school site measuring angles from different buildings and it was really fun because we got to go out. With food tech there's definitely a lot of skills that you can learn. They definitely all come out really delicious at the end. The wood tech has a lot of learning resources. They are really good. The textiles rooms are incredible. There's a lot of room for everybody to do their own work. We're having access to the mannequins and obviously the sewing machines are incredible. We have two drama studios, both fully equipped with sound and lighting. I love having drama in there. It's really exciting. The new tiered seating in the, in the main hall is a really cool feature. And in the corner of the main hall where there's the lighting box from the drama studio, that means that those that are doing drama for GCSEs are able to control the lighting in the whole hall and it's a more like professional space. The library in the new building looks absolutely great. I know so many people are so excited. It's a great way to like study, a place to relax and read. I think the canteen's amazing. There's a lot of room. There are around like 300 people in there, which is really good. The outside space is really nice. You can sit outside with your friends, have a little laugh and just enjoy your lunch outside. There's a lot of grass and there's a lot of benches. We've got some new table tennis tables. It's quite nice to just go outside and run around on the field and stuff. It's nice to have that freedom. While I've been at Little Heath, I've been on quite a few school trips. I've been on two trips to Belgium, to Rome as an RE trip, to PGL quite a few times. I went on a Bruges music tour as well. Yeah, there's lots of opportunities. Yeah, I went on the skiing trip to Bulgaria. The skiing was amazing. Sports-wise, it's all pretty good. The field is huge. We've got the Astro that people play on at like lunch times and after school for any clubs you might do. My favourite subject is PE and I love all the different activities. Obviously you get loads and loads of training um, as you would do for any sort of sports. The school really inclusive on all their sports teams. The girls netball team in my year, they did really well. Uh, sports day every year is the highlight of most people's years. It's like a big community over on the field. It's, it's a good day at the end. I'm in the football club and the rounders club and the athletics club. I really enjoy it because you're kind of representing the school and it makes you feel proud. We've got all different clubs, so if you're not as sporty then you have like art, debating. I just wanted to do chess club and it was really fun. And of course there's many other clubs that you could do. The drama department regularly put on plays. Being part of Beauty and the Beast was a great way of making friends across the whole school. And the plays have been amazing. D 
Dear V is a little expedition you do with some other people from the school. On Dear V, I didn't really know many people I was going with. They became like my best friends overnight because we went through so much together. So house competitions are really competitive and really fun. Everyone's always trying their hardest. I think that it's always fun to participate because even if you're not good at something, at least as long as you're trying, you'll have fun. Every year we do a carol service up at Tyler's Methodist Church. Along with the cow service, we have a uh, OAP party here at the school. It's a really good way to give something back to the community. We also got involved in the Turn Tarless Red campaign, which uh, raised a lot of money for Remembrance Day. I'm also part of Smile, um, which is the student peer mentoring programme. And they're there really for anything that troubles you. If you don't want to go to a teacher, you can find us around the school, wearing a little badge, a little smiley face. The facilities in sick form are really good. They're a bit more university style than sick form, They're, but the cafe is really good. And there's so many more subjects for us to take. We've got the common room, it's good for quiet study in that. The media facilities as well, really good for um, editing software and that. If I could uh, sum up Little Heath with one word, I'd say interesting. I think it would be friendly. Positive. Unique. One word to sum up Little Heath, um, social. Fun. Smiley. Um, my word to sum up Little Heath would be inclusive. Encouraging. One word I would use to describe Little Heath is home. Everyone's always smiling if you need help, so it's home.